So when you hear a preacher say, if you are hooked up on pornography, continue watching, but keep coming to church. Don't struggle not to stop the porn. Don't struggle at all. Just keep watching the porn. But as you're watching the porn, spend more time hearing the word. He works for Satan. You can't say it, but I'm called to say it. He's in league with the prince, with Bezebub. <laughs> That's a laugh. No wonder that people are feeding and still suffering Kwashoko. And you know, the good thing is that you can't really malign me in your churches anymore. Social media has made it very impossible for you because even while you're quoting me out of context in your pulpit, your members who follow me know that you're lying, sir. Maintain your honor and don't disrespect your status. So my family, and um, Dr. Ebe Damina has finally responded to uh, Apostle Arome's uh, claim by calling him that uh, Dr. Ebe Demina was working for the devil. So let's get into this video um, and watch it as well. I'll be back after the video. So subscribe, like, share, and comment. When we will not have a mature church. We will have a baby church. A church of infants that do not know how to stay without pampas. And that's why we've got to get into this thing and preach it well. Somebody shout, I hear you. Yeah, we've got to preach this thing. So guys, you've heard it from yourself. Uh, the Department of Corrections, you know, both uh, Pastor Ebe Debida and Apostle Arome uh, attempt as the office or the, or the Department of Correction where they correct uh, ministers in their, uh, in, their, um, in their capacity as they said God has called them to correct errors in the body of Christ. Now, but one of the issues I have is that is it proper to call another minister names if you don't agree with him based on what he says? I believe that uh, uh, the Christian body or men of God should get into maturity. When you are correcting someone, I believe it should be done in love and in truth, not in, by calling names. What I mean by calling names is that when you insult someone, like for instance, Apostle Arome called him, uh, he's working for Satan, he's working for the devil. I believe that we might different, we may have different ideas on doctrine. But I don't believe that uh, it is necessary to call the person um, names. For instance, in a family uh, you, of brothers and sisters, we may not agree of the same thing. doesn't mean that we are not from the same family. Uh, even we, that we have brothers and siblings, we don't agree on same issues. We have different thinking pattern. So I don't believe that that is the right way to correct by calling him uh, working for the devil. But I believe that... You can address it and love my family so so as i said even those from the same womb don't have the same uh, understanding or the same uh, they don't agree on similar thing but they never uh, they they can have issues but doesn't mean that they are not from the same family so i believe that it is high time our fathers in the faith know how to correct each other know how to correct each other in love not by calling out name calling people working for the devil calling people rat calling people elephant, but I believe if we have this understanding, I believe the body of Christ will be strong and united again. So my family, that's all I have to say on this subject. Uh, please, I want to know what you think in the comment section. Was it right? Is it right for men of God to call each other by names and insulting themselves? 